So another question is from uh, Kath Austria, another former classmate of mine back in junior high school in the Philippines. And uh, her question is, when is the right time to let go? Damn, that's a, that's a pretty deep question right there. Uh, I asked you guys if you wanted to like advice for like life in general or relationships. I'll, I'm just gonna assume, I'm just gonna assume that um, she's asking for like both things because, because why not? So her question is, when is the right time to let go? Uh, my rule of thumb when it comes to letting things go is that um, if it doesn't serve you anything anymore and it's just holding you back, just let it go. I mean, if it's holding you back for like a better job or like a better circumstance in your life. Or, uh, yeah, if it's just like hurting you and it doesn't really serve you in like any way, maybe it's better to like let things go. That also applies to like both life in general as well as for like relationships as well. Because if, if you're like in a toxic relationship and you're not really happy anymore, I mean, what's the point of like staying there? And although people might argue that. Um, it's better to deal with the demon or like, yeah, like the demon or like the struggle that you're familiar with. I mean, by the end of the day, if you're moving to like another new thing, that's also going to be familiar for you as well, like sooner or later. So might as well do it. Maybe, maybe it's going to be better for you that way. I mean, um, I mean, there's not really a right decision. Maybe it's all about. It's all about like fighting the demon that you're willing to fight. You know what I'm saying? You know, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to be deep here. I'm trying to be, I'm trying to act smart here. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, um, if you want to let go, or also maybe you're just being reckless, so try to like get that into consideration. Yeah, like try to get that into consideration as well. That you're just being reckless and you're not thinking things through, and like the first sign of trouble, you're wanting to to bail and like get out of there as quick as you can maybe that's also not the right decision to let go in like the first sign of trouble so keep a level head be reasonable be introspective and yeah like fight fight the the cons and pros and cons and that kind of stuff yeah um this this girl this lady Kath Austria is also a a kind of like a leader in her ministry or like in her um, religious group or something like that she's kind of like a youth leader or something she's a born-again christian for a bit of context for you guys i don't know if you guys care but it's that's out there and one of the I'm just trying to like to relate this to her situation because hey so good morning apple i i hope i said your name right sup apple uh, you guys can ask questions by the way. I'm just trying to like cue things up in here. I also have some questions here stored in advance. But yeah, uh, what I'm trying to say is that um, there's also this story in the Bible. I'm gonna get super religious in here. I'm not trying to convert any of you guys to like this religion. All I'm saying is that there's some stories in here that are like a bit applicable. Yeah, so there's like this story here about like um, this rich guy who went and talked to Jesus about like uh, how to go into heaven and and um, Jesus is like oh you want to go to heaven and you want to go to heaven you must be able to like let go of the possessions or like the riches that you have and it's not really about the thing about like um letting go of money or that kind of stuff because money is bad because to be honest we need money to pay the bills and that sort of stuff yeah uh, that sort of stuff but like if you I think it's more about like letting go of the things that you think are valuable to you to pursue something that's much more greater and that could be put into like um, numerous or like several several contexts like trying to let go of the things that you think are important uh, in order to gain something that is way more important I think that's like a definitive way when you want to know what to let go to like when to let go like when is the right time for that so yeah <laughs>